We're still on with stories concerning Russia. Now, since Russia started its invasion of Ukraine more than a year ago, the U.S. has been imposing sanctions on Russia to degrade Moscow's current and future military capabilities and right on its border with Mexico. As Mexico marked its 213th independence anniversary, the Russian troops were seen participating in the military parade there. Mexico celebrated a new anniversary of the beginning of the struggle for independence with a parade led by President Obrador. Obrador kicked off the celebrations by ringing the traditional bell. while the military parade was also attended by delegations from China, Colombia, Cuba, Ecuador, Nicaragua, Venezuela and Russia. The involvement of the Russian military has unleashed criticism for inviting a Russian delegation to participate in the parade. The Ukrainian ambassador to Mexico was amongst those who took to social media stating that the event was tainted by the Russian military's participation because their boots and hands as war criminals are stained with blood. Well, the ambassador also questioned the neutrality of Mexico in the ongoing war. While the Mexican president has repeatedly defended Mexico's neutrality towards the war in Ukraine. But some have now accused him of being biased towards Russia. And also, following sharp criticism, Mexico has given a platform to forces that invaded Ukraine. The Mexican president has defended the presence of Russian military units in the parade. Well, at a press conference, he said Mexico had allowed any country to join in as it has relations with all countries in the world and all of them are invited for the parade. Meanwhile, on the other hand, Russia's embassy in Mexico celebrated the Russian regiment's participation in the event. The Russian embassy said on social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter, long live the friendship between Mexico and Russia. Con paso firme y estoico, vemos pasar al personal militar de la Federación de Rusia.